Hey everyone, welcome back to Undeveloped Minds. Today, uh, me, Aaron, and my friend here, Jovan, will be talking Yo. about Yo. simple things in our lives as an unde- undeveloped oh. human being. Hello, Joe. Cool. How are you? I'm doing great, man. Today's been an eventful day, man. A lot of things to do, man. How I'm so? excited, though. Uh, like, what did you do today? I mean, it's another Saturday for me. Uh, I, so, by, well, when I say busy, I mean like watching movies, bro. Who doesn't watch movies yeah, on a I'm Saturday? When all the tests are over, man. Report, the report card is supposed to be in two weeks, I think. Let's say, yeah, just chill, watch movies, man. It's a fun time. Yeah. So for those who doesn't know, we just finished our tests and it's pretty lit. Yes, sir. Finally got some time to chill, you know? But yeah, on the topic of tests, yeah, fam. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, saucy. How do you think, what do you think about the school system? Like, like how the usual, like, grades define how smart you are. Like that type of system. Mm. You know, in my honest opinion, I think it's such a, a dumb way to test smartness for students. And it's just not, it's not an accurate test, in my opinion. Because tests, if you're giving tests to students to like to find out their smartness and their IQ and intelligence and stuff, uh, where students can cheat. It's not, like it's not that good, you know. Like there's a lot of factors going in. If students can cheat easily, and then it it will alter the you know the actual intelligence of the students. You yeah. Know? Well, like for me, I think I think it's just a matter of like they just teach us things like we wouldn't even learn honestly. Like oh yeah, like, true. I mean, imagine, like, what's the basic question we always ask? Like, um, what? Hey, miss. Hey, mister. Like, oh, will this <laughs> equation be on the test or something like that, right? Yeah. And we will then, never ask, like, our then, boss. That. Yeah. And then, like, and then, like, if it, it, it's not in the test, then we're like, oh, okay. That's like, okay, let's just get yeah, it out of care. my mind. It's filling yeah, up my storage care. room. Yeah, man. And you know, like you know what I just learned from Matt? I learned about like like integrals and stuff. And when I when I think about it, like when will I ever use this, man? When will I ever use this? It's kind of dumb why they teach us teach us stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah, I get you. Like I just think that it should be something like okay, let's say um you want to get in like um arts and music, yeah. I think you're yeah. you should just only learn music, arts, and maybe. Like three other subjects, maybe yeah, um, like English, 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 and yeah. your native language, and maybe culture, something like that, right? Society, yeah. uh, sociology, or something like that. Yeah, yeah. And then, like, I like the way they make it is so, like, oh, people have to do writing tests, which is like pretty dumb oh. for me because, because I think, like, so dumb. I think performance based tests are the way to go. Like, I'm just saying that, oh, yeah. that, like, at least with performance tests and like project tests, you can apply those things in your right, real life. Like, yeah, it actually you just kill, right? Yeah, yeah, Not yeah. actually, you can cheat if you're using a written test, which is a bad way to, you know. Yeah, yeah, I, I get, yeah. I get the vibe, and then especially like with performance based tests, it's like okay, let's just say like, uh, we so in English we just did a way like to yeah make a speech. Or like some yeah. to persuade people about doing something, which is really good because I guess in the future you can persuade yeah. someone to be like, yeah. to be like, oh, let's come on, um, buy my house or like buy this product I'm selling or something. That's like that, right? usual skill, right? Yeah, like imagine actually, you're in a business yeah. meeting, you can actually use the skill, you know, like to persuade like the investor to invest on your company. It's yeah, such a yeah, useful yeah. skill. Yeah. Like, Rather than math, bro. I'm like, just I'm not saying that math is bad. Like, oh. okay. I, yeah, can, same, same, same. I, can, I can see people enjoying math and like I can see them like using math in the future. Okay, let's say like there's yeah. someone who's like, oh, there's someone who works for like the anti-earthquake company or something. They they definitely would what use like an anti-earthquake uh, company. Yeah. <laughs> say, like, you know, you know those you know those companies who built like the the architectures for like the building structure in, in Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You probably would need math and physics for it, right? Oh, definitely, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and then like those people who make like I don't know, what are things we can use math for? Okay, maybe programming. Programming might have a bit of math here. Oh, yeah, yeah, programming has math, I think. Yeah, yeah, but like so I don't it, program. It's to a certain extent, you know, like 
like the amount of time yeah. we use the formulas the teachers teach us like on a daily basis is like one every like a thousand people like yeah so the amount of jobs yeah. around there like and I'm, I'm pretty sure not every person needs that advanced math skills that we were taught in school yeah definitely <laughs> yeah, yeah of course like, yeah. not everyone wants to be a mathematician or like have a math major or being become a math teacher so i wish they like toned down the math you know like toned it down yeah i wish i wish like, crazy calculus. like me and you are in like different social and science streams like he's on science stream and i'm on social streams okay uh it's the difference is basically like yeah. he's like like two months earlier than me and like two i'm like yeah two i learned more in events right yeah you learn your... like let's say like you're in like level five and i'm still at level four but we're at the same time but in the yeah. end in the end it's probably going to finish like you're going to be at level 15 i'm going to be at level 13 13 and a half like those type of levels <clears throat> i mean yeah yeah it's far yes but i mean no, still like i'm just saying that i think mathematics for for just mathematics purposes i think everyone can get off mathematics in just like basic junior high mathematics I, like i'm pretty sure um oh. if you yeah. stop learning mathematics during your junior high days i'm pretty sure you're set for life like i'm serious oh, the yeah. most common things humans use to with mathematics is basically counting money and who can't yeah, like, count money like like seriously yeah addition subtraction like the simple stuff maybe like some multiplying and some division but that, that's like the basics yeah yeah like like i'm pretty sure you can get off with like with like junior high level math yeah unless you want to be an engineer like if you're an engineer make sure to graduate yeah, yeah. bro or like yeah i don't want my engineers to be junior high graduates of math bro i'll be yeah, pissed yeah, yeah. that's like that's like on the subject base so i want to talk something about the school system as well but on the way they like teach us like like okay back to the earlier part of this text conversation <laughs> like <laughs> i just talked about like how i think performance tests are better than like um those you know writing tests and yeah, yeah. Like i that. agree i agree i agree yeah 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 like do you think like they should add like more writing tests? let's say let's say there's like usually like a writing test projects and like two assignments yeah. and then like a performance test so, like five different type of categories for learning right yeah 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 don't you think like there should then be like a writing test and then replace that with like let's say like a let's say a more like a conclusion test so like like you know when writing tests are usually like what we learn on the end of the semester but like we have to memorize them right but yeah. usually when we memorize them we don't usually understand about it right yeah we just memorize it yeah, like yeah. At, like maybe like the night before yeah yeah like let's say let's say we learn this specific math and then it's used for like discounts okay yeah. Like discounts or like coupon codes and stuff like that. I think they should make a test where you can like um how would you use this type of mathematics? Like and then we have to yeah, show yeah. them like how we can apply them in our daily life. So let's say for like discounts and stuff like that. Let's say you um you make your own like sort of like a business plan, sort of like <clears throat> like an advertising plan where like oh yeah, that's smart. Like yeah, you in the test you like how much profit can you make while while discounting you know yeah like how much well, like this having ten percent off or like what happens if you have ten wages with the same amount of salary and then suddenly you have to add two more wages um to their wage bill and then how would you balance out the profit like that's that's like something yeah, I you? think it will be way more useful than we just like Wait. what's what's two x times times four y yeah, like to the power of three or something like that. Yeah, or even like how to find an area of a box. Like, why would we need to know that? Like, oh uh, yeah, maybe yeah, I think would... maybe like if you are into, let's say, let's say you are people who make like the containers oh, for like, fish or something. You know, like you have to learn something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, not everyone wants to learn that. And like, I think. Yeah, yeah. I know math is like a variety of options. There's like a limitless amount of mathematics. Yeah, a lot of math. theories and everything. I think like they should target to those who want to learn those things. Let's say like. Let's say I want to get in business. Well, they should teach people who, like about discounts, advertising, promotions, like wage bills, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, income, outcome, and those things. Like if you want to learn about yeah, like, I... like how to build an aquarium or like architecture, yeah. maybe you have to like learn like volume, like area, square feet, yeah. everything like yeah, that. I you know? think 
I think I think schools should give an option about math because math is such it's like so diverse. You can't just put one math to one group of students because different students need different types of math, you know. Yeah, and like the fact that they expect the they expect us to learn those things in like I um, mean like let's say the test is in late March and then we're in we're at mid March. They usually just give yeah. out it and then we just like oh learn this like. I, I don't even care if you have like 10 other subjects, but learn this and I expect you to get like 80 plus so you can pass the test. Yeah, like, it's because you have a lot of subje- other subjects in math. We need to balance out. Yeah, I know. I know it's like they expect better. Like I get their perspective. Like they want us to succeed. I'm pretty sure they want us to succeed. But like you have to understand that we're not like robots, bro. Like I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah. We, need, we need, yeah, we need, we need some breaks and, you know, and projects, bro. Projects from other subjects are such there's, there's a lot of projects from our school personally yeah it's just a lot yeah, of yeah, projects yeah. i don't know about and any other people's school like i don't i don't know for like your school my school like i'm pretty sure every school is different in their own way but like yeah, definitely but like i'm just talking about it in general perspective like the way the way they apply these tests to us is very very ineffective <laughs> yeah like we could like, care less the, yeah the negatives of like putting a lot of work to students it's like the it, the mental health man it, it really just destroys yeah, the mental especially health especially like the way you can apply like peer pressure and like especially when your parents like pressure you to like oh, oh um yo Joe fun i expect you to get a 90 if not like i'll be disappointed cuz i dad was like a was like a top 5 student and mom was a always always that girl who not, got that scholarship not, or to that amazing college not even that not even that my parents use this technique. Sometimes they, they, they like they tell me like this: if you like, you need to get like an example here. You need to get an yeah. ninety on this test because I paid with my hard-earned money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get I, in this I, I, it, it makes you feel like feel bad. Like I actually need to like yeah, you know, yeah, get a yeah. ninety. Like, I feel bad. Like I know they worked hard for it, but sometimes like pressuring us is not even gonna help us. It's it's actually yeah, it just makes us nervous. Us. Like like oh fun. Like I don't know, man. Like. I'm gonna learn like for ten hours, and then the next of the day we're all tired. Like your yeah. brain can't function well, and then like you just woke up, you barely had something to eat and drink, and then you suddenly get attacked by this all of these tests. Is like, a, <laughs> like usually like our tests Crazy. are not even that like a lot of questions. It's not even like 20, 30, 50 questions. No, it's just like three yeah, questions. Like, but like three if you, five questions. Yeah, but if you like get one wrong, you you automatically oh. are below the average Dead. score, which is like Dead. Oh. yeah. Just because, like below just because out of like binomial theorem, sequence series, aromatic geometry, I can't do one of them. It doesn't mean I, I failed the whole test. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah, yeah. Out of like the variety of subjects, like I can understand that English is a very good one because it's communication. It's the way you communicate. Of course. of course it is. It's like it's the leading language, right? It's the most speak, speaking nah, language. I think it's Chinese, the then Spain. I don't know. <laughs> don't, 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 don't quote me on that. This is Spanish. I think I think they're just Spanish. Yeah, yeah. No, don't quote me on that. Don't quote me on that. Spanish. But like, but like, I'm serious. Like, English is a pretty good way, and maybe even Chinese to a certain extent, depending on what you want to learn. Uh, oh, <laughs> like, me, me, and me and Jovan are really bad at Chinese, but like, I'm just I'm saying. Worse than you. You you get seventies. I get twenties in Chinese. I just can't do Chinese. But Even like, though I'm Chinese myself, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, but, it doesn't but, make sense. But I can see someone like, like actually getting a career off of it, you know? Oh yeah, like you know, like people who who is like multi like bilingual yeah, yeah, or like yeah, multilingual, yeah, like yeah. can speak a lot of languages and actually very good assets for like certain companies to maybe yeah, want to yeah, expand. Yeah. Like such a good, such a good, good like good skill to have. You I know? think I think they just just add like some more programs. I guess not really. I think it should make us. Let's say we have like what, nine subjects? Is? No, fourteen, right? No, 12, 13. 12. 13, 13, 13, 13. Like I think quite 13. a lot, quite a lot. Let's above ten, obviously. But like yeah, above ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like I mean, I think they should like make us like um like, you know, like the ones you have to take. Like let's say um you have to take what, let's say you have to take like three major ones they pick. Okay, let's say uh, out of nowhere, yeah. let's say it's like um math english and native language okay yeah and then like they should add like let's say 
we should only have a total of like eight or okay, maybe 10, but like, let's say you have like seven other options, right? You can, I, yep. I think students should be able to pick them whether or not, not the way like we oh. have like social or science stream, which is like very limited. Like imagine well, the limits you can only get right? from like social and science stream. That's so limited. Yeah, so you don't need specific have, subjects, yeah, right? You don't even have things like, like sports stream or like someone who wants to be good as an athlete, you know? They wouldn't really care stream. about about getting biology, physics, chemistry, <laughs> like sports, and like theory sports. Maybe, maybe you know. Yeah, or yeah, like, yeah. Or like communication streams, where like you just learn like how to communicate and how to persuade people. You know those type of things. Yeah, or even like, arts, music, arts. I think know? like they should they should like add more streams or like maybe have like three major subjects just like everyone has to learn them, but like have like four or five so other subjects just that that really benefits but us. Like, hey, like what there's there's like a problem though if schools like schools made a lot of streams and it's not even public schools or like maybe like private schools oh, yeah like, yeah a lot of, like the students wouldn't like it, there would be like two students per stream you know like yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I get i get that theory as well but i think like you know maybe maybe they should add like oh let's say not stream okay maybe maybe subjects is like pick subjects is, you know Oh yeah, like, I think that would be better. Like five subjects and what then like three do? other, like you have you like can, three like, main subjects. subjects, and then like you have like out of ten, you have to pick five. You know those type of things. Yeah, and yeah. if you fail the subjects that you pick, that's on your that's your own fault. You know, like yeah, you yeah, yeah. The wrong it's, subjects, it's your you choice. Know? You know, like yeah, it's your I'm choice. Sure I I think there's some places that uh, that do that, but like it's not a general and like not a global thing yeah. that everyone does. Yeah, I think I, I think my yeah. our friends, our friend school does that, right? Yeah, yeah, some of our friend school that has like international curriculum. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, we do have international curriculum here, but like, yeah, I think they have like right? a more advanced version of ours, like, like, uh, like the IGCSEs in ours, like just the basic I, IGCSEs. I would, say, I would say more of a modern take on like yeah, 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 international I, curriculum. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where they made it more like you can pick which one you want, and if you fail, it's your own fault. You know, like yeah, yeah. I think that's a, that's a good step. You know, in the future, I want yeah. my kids to do that or like have that option available. Yeah, and like I, I just think like they can tackle the situation in like so many different ways instead of just giving us. Yeah. Like if they want it's, us yeah, to learn about test. about about indices and like binomial theorem <laughs> and like you know you know those type of vibes of mathematics and let's say for like. Yeah, they yeah. want to learn like they want us to learn like um how much force does an apple have if it falls from the Burj Khalifa or something like that. Right? <laughs> <laughs> like let's say if they want us to learn those type of things, right? <laughs> <laughs> like I, yeah, I'm yeah. pretty sure they should have just made it like as a fun ex like a fun experiment, like be an <laughs> apple. Yeah. Like, like maybe they should ask us, oh, let's let's grab an apple, let's build something, let's build something like like an extension or a, a sort of like a tripod or something, and then like drop it from the ceiling of your, room, of your yeah. room or something and then that would be way more fun than yeah, like then, actually then, learning the when it hits the ground like i don't know i'm pretty sure they they have something to like um you know measure the weight and the stuff like that like measure the speed yeah, and like course. theories for that you know yeah I mean, yeah of course more to, like experiment based you know like like i'm pretty sure like yeah, yeah. that's that's in like medicine but like you know in like medicine is like a harder topic i know it's something people learn in college but I think they should apply yeah, yeah. in like high school because because it's like the, the stepping stones, you know, the roots. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. Like like medicine's like like it's very important. And I think like if you yeah. teach it like in high school, like it will like get, make it so the students will be like used to like talking about these advanced terms. So when they yeah, are in yeah, college, yeah. They can, like, like oh I get that. I get what it means, you know. Like at least not not like you don't have to go in in depth into it, but just more like the basic theories about it. Like yeah, like the like, sea, like the like the above, like the surface yeah, yeah. Like, level. You so know? like, like the theories, like caffeine helps with um, dizziness, nausea, and stuff like that. You know. Yeah, like because like the, because it talks the blah blah blah. Yeah, like, yeah, so. yeah. Like those type of theories. Like I know this is like a basic term. Like um, yeah, and maybe and in Jofan, college they really make it more stuff, you know? But like this is our perspective. This is our yeah. undeveloped minds perspective to this. Un topic. Undeveloped minds. <laughs> you, <see what laughs> yeah, you, you get it. You get it. <laughs> Well, like, like, yeah, that's the other thing. Like, what, like, what positives can you take out of this current system we have? Like, uh, like to be honest, 
I don't think written tests should be like demolished all completely demolished. Yeah. I think performance should be like dominating, like maybe like 80% and written should be 20%. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. I get all it. performance, like how do you teach like some students who want to be like an engineer, like have a math major, mathematician? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. How do you how do you perform X X two plus blah blah blah? Yeah, like yeah. Equals blah, blah, blah. Okay, okay. How I do you perform you. that? I, yeah, yeah. I think like some suggestions does need like those written tests, but like yeah, those written like, tests. I get like I understand the fact that um, what you call it, like I think performance based tests should be more dominant of uh of the ratio yeah. for the final um result than like a yeah, written the test. Result. Like I'm pretty sure it's like it's like a three. Three to ten ratio, like like I'm pretty sure thirty percent of our scores are from the written tests, and the others are from like the six other scores we have to get around the school year, which is pretty yeah. like it's way more dominant on that side, obviously. Yeah, but like I wish, like you know, performance should be more dominant than like yeah. written tests. And there's one other thing, man. One positive I can get. Yeah. You yeah. know. When when you're like trying, you know, have you ever experienced like when you're trying to memorize like for this test tomorrow, you come yeah. with your friends. It creates like a, such a fun experience, you know. Yeah, and yeah. I'm pretty sure. High, we had like this one group, right? Where yeah, we talked yeah. a lot. Yeah, it was such if a. If you fun have that time. specific friend group that helps you a lot, that that's something you should like cherish into because like you won't get oh, yeah, a lot of those yeah, type of so people. Fun. Yeah, yeah, but like I'm pretty sure fun, fun. the best thing about school right now, like the best thing about school is just interacting with friends and especially like during the season like we can't do those things because because we're in like yeah. pandemic and stuff like that but like yeah and yeah that's like one of the positives like, you can get from like like having long-term school you know yeah yeah and like now we're in like high school right like pe- pe- my mom and like my parents and my like my relatives always told me t- told me like you know high school is very fun you should like it's the most funnest part of your student life or something like yeah, that yeah, like, yeah. It's the fun part and like we're in quarantine, like, which yeah, sucks, I know, you know, I know. Like I can't experience to the fullest extent like how fun it it is for like the first. And you're almost we're over. Basically gonna earn, we're gonna year, basically man. we just wasted like a year of our lives. Yeah. Of our high school lives <laughs> in quarantine, so like yeah, man. It's like so we don't annoying. know how it feels really, but like and we'll we, see, we'll see. I I hope we get at least the next two years. Oh, I hope. I hope. I, I hope. Like, hope. like we're not like we're not guaranteed like. The next school year yeah, will yeah. be in school like hybrid. Like it's such such an annoying situation to be at, you know. Especially with like the current developments and like like there's no clear vaccine and like there's no clear time where this pandemic will end. So yeah, we just but, gotta live by it, you know. <laughs> yeah, but like when I read the news, like people are like like some presidents presidents from like countries are like saying vaccines are clear to go and like it's a good step. Like you know, it's like yeah, it's a, yeah. It's a big, I mean, we're moving in the right like, direction, just not. Yeah, definitely. The fastest direction, you know? <laughs> I mean, did you know, like, the COVID vaccine was, like, the, the fastest vaccine created ever? Maybe. Maybe not, you know? No, it was. It's, like, it's written down. Like, you see, vaccine takes, like, one to two years. The COVID vaccines only, like, like yeah, yeah, seven yeah. months. But, but I'm, I'm kind of sure. This, whatever happens, I just wish we can go back to school. Because, like, we haven't experienced yeah, because... the fullest extent of school. <laughs> like, our yeah, high school. Back yeah, to the even when you're... In... Oh yeah, sorry. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, and even when we're like in grade nine, which is like like the end of junior high, like yeah, close to high. School. Some people would say it's already high school, but like like it was such such a fun time, and we're and we were getting like national exams and stuff. But it was so fun. Like yeah, I'm imagine pretty in the, sure it like was nine. just about a year ago. <laughs> it was not no way. Oh, you know, one year the, ago yeah, it was yeah. our last day at school. Yeah, it, realized. I'm pretty sure like it's. It was on a Friday, right? And then the Monday. Yeah, it was on a Friday. And March the Monday, 13, it was supposed to be like our written tests, like our midterm tests. Yeah. And then it yeah, was canceled. Then, like, so pretty cool. <sighs> pretty cool. You know, I was very happy, you know. That, yeah, but I, I was very happy was at first because like, I noticed like, yes, I didn't have to learn for anything because like, I'm pretty sure I would fail this test. But like, <laughs> yeah. but, like after, like, then, after yeah. like a couple months went by, it's pretty, pretty sad. I know? regret it, bro. I actually regret it. Like, Cause, I would have rather struggled through that point, but yeah, I still have yeah. my friends around me, you know, you know? I know. And, and, you know, the worst part was we were promised, like, two weeks only for quarantine. And now it's one Yeah, year it was, like, two weeks. Oh, but, yeah. Two, was, like, a month. Something like that. Yeah, Anyways, like, like, the positives about school again, I'm pretty sure it's, like, I, I like, 
you can you can learn that the school system actually like wants you to learn like a lot of things for like what you want to be in the future, right? Yeah, for elementary, I think like elementary school, we learn a lot. Like we yeah, elementary, right? junior high, I'm pretty sure it's a good thing. Like, I know they only divide into two, but like the good thing about the school system is like, like it's can it can be something like a variety of lessons that you can base your future around. You know, like yeah, that's like from from someone who doesn't know what they want to be in the in like the next two or three years, <laughs> this current school system would be so so much more beneficial for you. Like because. Because like you can learn like the varieties of subjects, even though it's still limited to that specific street. Yeah, it's you know? like dipping your feet in water, you know, like yeah, like yeah. Just stepping like a little not bit. everyone like, oh, can take like, like yeah. five lessons, you know, out of out of the blue. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they should. I, yeah, I agree yeah, with and, like the school system like giving it a lot of subjects so students can like in like a little bit like yeah, just yeah. Surface, you know? But I think I think for me to counter that, I think they should have like a psychologics test like. You know the one we take where before oh. we went in junior uh, oh, high yeah. school, sorry. Yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they could like take those type of tests and then base it around like those subjects. Like just make the simplest questions about the subjects. Like, are you interested in the way a house is built? Are you interested in how um this computer was built yeah, and programmed and I, or something like that? And then like you can yeah, like, see, pretty- like how how interested they are. And then like when the results come, they should like recommend you, like. The like ten subjects or like not even ten like at least five subjects is like you're gonna be good at or like at least happy to be there you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think like, that's that's a good way to inter- um counter. And fact. another thing is yeah, yeah. like if you give those type of test to the like elementary students, they won't be like smart enough. Like, oh, it's they will be like thinking, oh, oh, do I like building houses? Oh, I like them. Like they yeah, don't like, like I play like, Minecraft. <laughs> yeah, I play Minecraft. I build houses every day, and maybe like. They could be yeah, like a future engineer. But, but like, I'm pretty sure when you're around 12, 13, 14 even, I'm pretty sure you are set like, I'm pretty sure your mind is developed enough to the point where like you understand that these questions are like something you should um, take like a pinch of salt to. But like I should think like what you're going to answer to, you know? Yeah, yeah, you actually can think like, oh, oh, so they're I tricking think that's me. A like, good thing, you yeah. know? Like maybe, maybe for the first year in senior high school, or like high school in general, like it, mm-hmm. it's fine for having like the two basic streams like science and social. But maybe for like the next term, the next year, I mean, they should yeah. have um like those tests where we can find out like which subject we should take. You know. Yeah, the high school is like we're preparing for college. Like, you need to know. It's just it's like basically our roots, part. right? Yeah, it's like basically like, oh, you want to be this, so you gotta cry to be to get like to get accepted in this specific like university in the specific major it's it's like yeah high school's like yeah you understanding what you want to be which is which i'm not doing really well <laughs> yeah yeah like <laughs> like i i don't i i don't know what i want to be right now well i have like I, like I have like a couple options on the table you know but like yeah, but sure everyone has like like a couple options like three or two to three options like what yeah. are you going to be right but, now? yeah you know? but it's not like I want to be this. Like, it's not 100% confirmed. Yeah, it's, it's like, 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 I want yeah, to be this, I but I also want to be this. But, like, either yeah. one works. But, like, I think it sometimes works. I prefer this one at a certain age. And then, like, this one was really tempting for me, like, when I was 16, 17. <laughs> yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Like, right now, I'm trying, like, every like everything I can. Like, doing this podcast, like, doing a little bit of YouTube. Maybe, like, put, doing some public speaking. You know? I'm actually interested yeah, in just, doing just dip, it, in dip your feet into anything, honestly. Yeah, honestly. Because after, after you're in college, I'm, when you're in college, actually, I'm pretty sure you won't have, like, you, you already have time to have that major set in your life, you know? Because, like, well, this yeah. is it. Like, if you drop up, you, if you drop up, if you drop out, you're literally <laughs> wasting, like, money. Like, time. Sure money. money and time. time, money, effort, Blood, sweat, it's just a risky, you know. It's very risky. Everything, and everything. If you just drop out and yeah, it's like so risky at that point. So yeah, well, I'm pretty sure yeah. we dived into this topic pretty well. Yeah, like, I would say as as a mind of the of an undeveloped mind, undeveloped person. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I um for those who have stick around for the past like 20, 30 minutes with us, thank you for listening. To our rambling yes, and our sir. thoughts 
and I hope to see you. And Jovan also hopes to see you guys on the next sure. episode. See ya. Peace out.